Front Row Motorsports just dropped a bombshell by announcing that Todd Gilliland won't be competing full time. But who will be taking over the wheel of the number 38 Ford? That's right, it's none other than reigning Truck Series champion Zane Smith. We'll take a closer look at their shared driving duties and Front Row Motorsports trend of switching up their driver lineup every year. But that's not all, folks. We'll also fill you in on some of the rule changes NASCAR has announced for the 2023 season. Get ready for some high-speed action, because we're talking about stage racing on road courses without any caution flags to slow things down. And if you're a fan of those daring moves, we'll cover the provisions that penalize drivers who use tactics like Ross Chastain's Hail Melon action at Martinsville Speedway. So buckle up, racing fans, because we've got all the latest news and gossip from the NASCAR world coming your way. Front Row Motorsports, the team behind the number 34 and number 38 Fords, have just announced their lineup for the 2023 NASCAR Cup Series season. While Michael McDowell is still set to return to the driver's seat for the sixth consecutive year, fans were surprised to learn that Todd Gilliland won't be competing full-time this season. However, there's still plenty of excitement ahead for Front Row Motorsports fans, as the team has revealed that Zane Smith, reigning Truck Series champion, will be sharing the number 38 Ford with Gilliland. While Gilliland will still be the primary driver of the number 38 Ford, Smith is set to compete in six races throughout the 2023 season. His races will include the Cup Series events at Phoenix Raceway, Talladega Super Speedway, Charlotte Motor Speedway, Sonoma Raceway, Texas Motor Speedway, and the Charlotte Motor Speedway Roval. This is an exciting opportunity for Smith, who signed an extension with Front Row Motorsports last summer and was originally expected to drive a third car. Front Row Motorsports has a long history of mixing up their driver lineups from year to year, and this season is no exception. Smith is set to become the fifth driver of the number 38 Ford since 2019, and McDowell will be welcoming his sixth teammate since joining the team in 2018. In fact, for the season opening Daytona 500, Front Row Motorsports will even be bringing back a third car, with Gilliland driving the number 38 and Smith driving the number 36 Ford. It's worth noting that Gilliland's reduced schedule means that only 33 drivers are currently set to run all 36 races on the 2023 schedule. Gilliland won't be playoff eligible as a part-time driver, though he could still land an additional ride with another team to make himself a full-time driver again. Despite the changes, the number 38 team will remain eligible for the owner championship. Overall, this is sure to be an exciting season for Front Row Motorsports and their fans with plenty of fresh faces and new opportunities to shake up the field. Keep an eye on the number 38 and number 36 Fords as they hit the track and take on the competition. During a recent media conference, Todd Gilliland opened up about his unexpected change in status with Front Row Motorsports. They didn't just tell me, this was a couple months ago. I think the hardest thing was just kind of expecting to be full time and then just kind of felt like it came out of nowhere. Really, there wasn't much to talk about it at all. That's the tough part. Gilliland's honesty about the situation shows just how much this news caught him off guard and how difficult it can be for drivers in the NASCAR industry. Despite the challenging circumstances, Gilliland also expressed that he doesn't hold any ill will towards his new shared driver teammate, Zane Smith. I haven't spoken to him, Smith, since the news actually came out, but I'm sure we're still gonna be friends. It's a tough business. It's something that I mean Marissa, my new wife, talked about. It's hard to be friends with people that you're competing against every single week. I've even ran into good friend Harrison Burton, and you're bound to have stuff happen, whether it's on the racetrack, stuff like this. Gilliland's comments show that even in a highly competitive industry like NASCAR, friendships can still exist, and drivers can show respect and understanding towards one another. The 2023 NASCAR season is also shaping up to be one full of excitement and surprises as the sport's governing body has just announced several rule changes that are sure to help shake things up. First and foremost, fans of stage racing on road courses will be pleased to learn that things will be taking on a whole new look in the coming season. That's right, NASCAR has confirmed that no caution flags will interfere with the flow of action during these races which is sure to create some truly thrilling moments. But that's not all. 
in a move that is sure to please some fans and frustrate others. NASCAR has also stated that it will be enforcing rulebook provisions to penalize vehicles that use a strategy similar to Ross Chastain's Hail Melon action at Martinsville Speedway by applying a time penalty. If you're not familiar with the move, it involved Chastain making a dash around turns three and four in his number one Chevrolet, gaining five spots in one set of corners and earning enough points to advance to the championship four. While it was an exciting move, it also violated NASCAR's safety regulations, which is why they've decided to crack down on this type of behavior. Now, rather than adding new wording to the rulebook, NASCAR will point to rule 10.5.2.6.A, which states that the safety is a key concern and any violations that jeopardize the safety of the event or its participants will be treated seriously. This move is sure to be controversial among fans and drivers alike, as some will see it as a necessary safety measure, while others will argue that it takes away from the excitement of the sport. Of course, this isn't the only rule change that has drivers talking. Many have also been discussing the topic of wall riding, which has been a topic of debate for some time. Two-time champion Joey Logano and 2020 championship winner Chase Elliott have both expressed praise for the move, acknowledging how fun it appears, while also recognizing the risk involved. All in all, the 2023 NASCAR season is shaping up to be one full of surprises and twists, and fans can't wait to see what's in store. With new rules and regulations coming into play, it's anyone's guess who will come out on top, and that's exactly what makes this sport so exciting. So get ready to buckle up, because it's going to be a wild ride. Thanks for tuning into this video. We hope you enjoyed this. From the exciting changes to stage racing and on-road courses to the enforcement of safety regulations, it's sure to be a season full of twists and turns. Make sure to stay tuned for more updates as the season approaches, and be sure to hit that subscribe button so you don't miss a thing. Thanks again for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.